Welcome back to the channel everyone. Today we're talking quilts. No, not these quilts. We're talking about lightweight backcountry quilts. Stay tuned. Like I said, today we're going to be talking about quilts. It's what I carry. And undoubtedly quilts were uh, first utilized by hammock campers. I'm a tent camper, but I carry a quilt anyway, and I'm going to give you the reason why. If you have a sleeping bag, it's going to be heavier than a quilt, of course. The quilt covers the top side of your body, but not underneath or uh, whatever's above your sleeping pad. The sleeping bag goes it fully encapsulates you and whatever your body is compressing onto the sleep pad, you're losing the R value of that insulation. Therefore, in theory, you're carrying extra weight in your pack and it does nothing significant to increase your R value or your warmth when you sleep at night. My quilt of choice is the Bandit Top Quilt by UGQ. This is a ultimate down 850 fill power. It's good down to 20 degrees. And when I say 20 degrees Fahrenheit, that is the comfort rating according to the uh, guys and gals over at UGQ. I got in touch with them, talked to them personally, and that is what they told me. This is a cottage company based out of Jackson, Michigan here in the US. They, the, the down that they use, and before I get into that, down is super compressible. So it packs really well. The only downfall to down is the, you can't get it wet. So you gotta make sure that you, uh, you have this stowed safely in your pack and it's not gonna get wet. Uh, it's not waterproof by any means. And if it does get wet, you will lose your insulating value, which, uh, could potentially be dangerous and that goes with a sleep down sleeping bag as well uh, down jacket that's any down so with that being said this is 850 fuel power down like I said the company UGQ uh, I got in touch with the founder and let's see Mr. Paul McWalters sorry I had to think about it for a minute and he told me that they use RDS out of Los Angeles. That's who provides them with their down, and they are responsibly sourced down. Therefore, that means that any down that goes into their product is responsibly sourced, meaning uh, it, it is a humane harvest for those of you who are concerned about that. So, yeah. Uh, UGQ is my brand of choice. I find that their price is very, uh, I'm going to say mid-range, very economical compared to some of your upper range bags and quilts. And their customer service is spot on. My particular pad, and th these things are fully customizable. You can choose your type of material you want. I just chose green and orange. I just why but anyway <laughs> so uh, I have a lighter weight nylon on the inside than on the outside uh, so the outer shell is a little more uh, tough uh, my foot box uh, snaps together and I'll, I'll cut away to show you that it snaps together has a zipper and a drawstring so you can fully encapsulate your feet for those of you who like a foot box that's called the foot box and if you like your feet wrapped up at night this thing can do that in your hotter temperatures you can lay it flat like a blanket um, it also comes with the pad straps which strap around your sleeping pad it helps keep everything snug down it keeps you cozy at night and there are a few other options that uh, you can get uh, from UGQ I'm not up to speed on every option because I got the options that were good for me but uh, I invite you to go to their website. It's uh, www.ugq.com, I think it is. Anyway, uh, Underground Quilt Company, LLC, is the full name. And 
they would be more than happy to answer any questions you have and fix you up with a custom quilt of your choice. They also have some that are pre-made, so you don't have to wait. I think there's a six to eight week lead time. Do not quote me on that <laughs> because I'm, I'm, I haven't been on their website, shame on me. But uh, yeah, um, I think this is a great quilt for the money. I've taken this thing down to 24 degrees in the Grand Canyon one night and 30 and 32 in, on two other nights and I did not lose a wink of sleep. Uh, I, I'm totally good with it, uh, comfortable. Um, in full disclosure, I am a hot sleeper so if you're a cold sleeper you may want to get a little more fill power or drop your rate, temperature rating down a little bit. But lightweight, this thing bunches up into hardly anything at all. I use it at the very bottom of my pack, inside my pack liner, and it helps fill all the voids by everything else that you put in there. If you put a, a stuff sack, it leaves little nooks and crannies here and there. This helps to eliminate some of that when I pack it in there. And um, I'm proud of this quilt. I mean, I love it. Uh, I, I, I felt it was a very fair price when I researched quilts and uh, other items of the like and found this was, like I said, uh, a lot of bang for the buck and the customer service was spot on. So I highly recommend getting yourself a quilt. Uh, if you have any questions for me, please feel free to drop them down in the uh, in the comments. I'll, you know, I'll jump on that and get with you and uh, if you got any questions directly for UGQ I know that they'd be happy to help you out and like I said they're a cottage company small company based here in the US so uh, they don't have a whole lot of overhead as far as the bigger companies so they can pass along some savings to you and you're supporting a small business here in the United States so think about it hard and uh, but don't think too long. Just jump on their website, get you a quilt, and uh, I guarantee you, you'll be comfortable in the back country just like I am. So there we have it. We talked quilts, short video. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. If you have not yet, I ask you please subscribe. Ring that notification bell and get notified every time we come out with a new video. In case you didn't notice the little logo on the bottom corner of your screen right there, that will get you right to the subscribe button. Uh, very easy to do. It helps support the channel. And um, I thank you for watching and stay tuned. We're going to be having more videos coming out soon. Until then, just a reminder to get out doors.